going to tell you the areas that you're going to be assessed against during the interview. So when you're preparing for the interview, you can work around these specific areas. Now the first part or the first area that you could get asked questions on relates to the reasons why you want to join the Royal Navy. They're going to want to know what reasons um, are you going to give us why you want to join the Royal Navy. You know, you, you know, you want the challenge, it's a professional organisation, you know, you want to improve yourself um, physically and mentally, get yourself a good trade, you need to have good reasons why you want to join the Royal Navy. Okay, the next area that, you, that you'll be assessed against is the reasons why you've chosen your specific career. So they might say, okay, we noticed that you want to be an air engineer, why is that? Tell us why you want to be an air engineer. And they need to be good reasons. It's we'll also want to know what information you know about the Royal Navy its lifestyle and also the training. They're also going to want to know about your hobbies, your interests and that includes sporting activities. If you don't do any sporting activities then I'm not saying it's too late to go and um, join some but I'd get out there and I'd try and join some kind of team activity whether it's football, it's hockey, netball, rugby, whatever it is it needs to be a sporting activity because it will allow you to respond to the interview questions um, far easier than if you didn't do any. They will also want to know about your personal responsibilities. So what personal responsibilities do you already have? So they will want to know information about your family. And it's not personal information, but they'll want to know about what do they think about you wanting to join. They will also ask you information which is based around your application form. So they'll say, right, see here on your application form, it says X, Y, and Z. Tell us a little bit about this. So you need to understand or remember what information you've put down on your application form. They are also going to want to assess you against your experience of work and also your experience of um, education. Whatever it is, you know, you should have a part-time job because it will demonstrate to the interview panel that you've got a level of responsibility. And that all helps when you're joining um, a service like the Royal Navy because it demonstrates that you've already got some form of routine and discipline in your life and you can actually hold down a job. why do you want to join the Royal Navy? And it's a question that you're almost guaranteed to get asked. I'm going to say, I've wanted to join the Royal Navy for a number of years now, and I feel that I've now reached a part of my life where I'm ready to commit to the service. Having what does your family think of you wanting to join the Royal Navy? Discuss the issue with them in depth, and I've also shown, shown them all of the recruitment literature to try and dampen any fears that they may have. They were a little bit concerned about uh, me joining, but they...